Oh, good morning, bright and early. We're still at Wakulla Springs. Gonna take a boat ride here this morning just after breakfast because I'm not swimming in that water with those alligators. If, if you saw that yesterday, I'm not, not about to do that. Everything seems a lot more peaceful out here than it did yesterday when it was pouring on us. Swimming area rules. A lot more than your regular neighborhood pool for good reason. Don't see any alligators out here, but I know they're there. You cannot fool me. We're about to take a boat out onto this body of water. And a little pontoon boat. We're ready to shove off. Just left and you can already see the tail of an alligator. That willow branch in the water. We got a giant manatee. Oh, it's literally right there. Awful lot of manatees out here. Now, what is bigger than the other? Look Ooh, at that. A couple of alligators. Oh, I'm looking on the wrong side, don't watch it. Couple of them, it looks like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Beyond that, female Sawani Hooter Turtle on your left. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Shell is part of their skeleton. Snake in the bush. Uh, that was fun. That was pretty wild. What'd you think? That was cool. I like it. Do you, do you want a pet gator now? Yeah, I don't want a pet gator. You want to pet anything. I'm not gonna lie, after seeing all those gators, I thought I would be even more afraid to go in the water here, but to be fair, I actually, I, I probably feel a little bit more comfortable now. Still not going to, but I'm no longer questioning their sanity. I don't think we saw any alligators quite as big as old Joe here. Oh, but my goodness. Cola Springs is also well known as being the filming location of the old classic creature from the Black Lagoon. Next stop on our tour, we're driving back to Alabama. So I guess we'll pick it up from there. See you later, Florida. It's been nice getting rained on. Look at how pretty these flowers are. Welcome to the small town of Fairhope, Alabama. The beauty of vlogging, with this one click of a button, I can skip forward about seven hours in time. But one thing that has not changed in those seven hours is it, it is raining. Just a little bit of that typical Gulf Coast misting rain, nothing too troublesome. Oh, okay. Maybe I spoke too soon. Maybe it's not gonna rain. Oh, well I hope the rain holds off for this view. Ooh wee, look at that sunset. That is very cool, overlooking the Mobile Bay. In fact, way out in the distance there, you can just make out the outline of what I believe is the skyline of Mobile, Alabama. I like they even have these little bird houses here, just off land here, just set up. Bird houses. After driving all day, it's very nice to get a beautiful view like this. I don't have my zoom lens with me, so I need to use this pier to get out there as far as possible. It's very pretty out here along the coast of Mobile Bay. My goodness, this pier is a lot longer than I thought it was. Did not expect to have to walk a mile just to get a closer view of the sun. Got some boats docked up here. I hope I can get all the way down there before the sun completely sets. Boy, it's a moment like this where I regret not bringing my drone along on this trip. This would be an epic shot. Whew. I kid you not, I've been walking for at least a good eight to 10 minutes. This might be close to maybe a half mile long pier if I had to guess. There's probably somewhere on the internet I can figure out how long this thing really is, but I've been walking for at least 10 minutes now and I'm not even hardly stopping. Almost there and there it is. Wow, just to the right there you can still see the silhouette of a downtown. A lot of water in today's episode. Not too many gators out here though. We do have a paddle boarder, slightly less life-threatening. What do you think of the view? Yeah, that's a paddle boarder, way out there. Tiny little dot. I don't know. He's he's out there paddle boarding. Why does anyone paddle board these days? Looking back at the mainland into Fairhope. 
there it is. Okay, maybe that's a little much. That was worth the 10 minute walk down here for sure. Very neat. Very good way to end today's vlog. Very pretty. Very awesome. Thank you guys for watching. I'm not sure if there will be a video yet tomorrow because, I don't know, when I'm out here on these small towns, small hotels, I don't always have internet to upload stuff, but I might film tomorrow. Only a couple days left of this trip. I'll be in New Orleans in a few days, or about a day now. I'll be in New Orleans, so I uh, might get some cool stuff there, and then I'll be about it, so thank you for joining me for this little vlogging experiment. Like I said the other day, the experiment's almost over. We'll be back to normal racing stuff, other videos that you're used to seeing on this channel before, before too long. So thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. And uh, I'll see you later.